Welcome back guys, today I'll be showing you once again how to get any SDC completely free. EA have made it really easy, so whether you want an 83 times 10 whether you want Cafu, Omri, whatever you need, I've got you covered. And all you've got to do to say thank you is subscribe and drop a like down below. And of course, if you do want some coins, hit a bit of a quicker way. Well, if you guys are still stuck with a team like this, and everyone you play in champs has a team like this, then you need to head over to Skycoach in the link below. Not only have they got the cheapest and most reliable service for FIFA coins, you can pick any amount of coins, select your console, and put in code PROREECALL for 10% off. Now, first of all, the first SBC that we're going to get completely free is the one of 83 rare gold player pick. Now, not only does this give us back some bronze packs, which is obviously really useful to complete some of the other SBCs out there, it's actually really good to get yourself very clearly some fodder. Obviously, do not make the wrong pick there because out of these three picks, obviously, I've got two 88s, which is actually really nice. All I've had to get for these three players is I've done, what is it, three sets of... 11 commons times two you're looking at about 66 commons in there you've got six rares i think so actually for the sake of pretty much nothing i've got myself kimmich and garujo now what am i going to do with those i'm going to go pop them into one of the other sbcs that we've got at the minute looks like i'm being sort of muddied with that one there unfortunately but we can put these guys into one of the other SBCs that we've got at the minute. Of course, the 88 Exchange. So obviously, you see them bronze packs there. They are the result of completing the one of three 83 plus picks. It was one of four, actually. So let's just go over to the upgrades just to take a look at that. Now, if we go here, you'll see I've already completed those. So you get three per account. It's two SBCs to complete, and they are both commons. And in those two sets, you need 22 players, and three of them are rare. So in total, you need nine rares, and then you need the rest to be commons. Honestly, very, very simple, and you've seen the result there. Very, very good. Now, how do we get these commons for free initially? Well, pretty simple. You get your daily bronze, silver, and gold done. So bronze here, two bronze players gets you a premium bronze packs. Two silver players gets you two silver in premium packs and then we obviously go to the daily gold upgrade and we complete these challenges then we get the daily gold upgrade completed and that's 44 commons so a pretty good contribution if you just want to put it into the 83 plus but that's not what we're going to do what we're going to do is we're going to craft these as a couple places you can choose you either go premium mixed league upgrades like this one here or this one here either or whichever obviously depending on what players you get might sort of dictate what you do with them or we go marquee matchups or daily fantasy FC challenge. So these two SBCs here, if you have the coins to do so, complete them with coins anyway. They are guaranteed profit. It makes sense to do so. Go on Footbin and complete them via the, the squads on there. Then obviously on your upgrade side of things, let's say you just you've, you've gone and spent the coins on the challenges. You've maybe made five ten k. You've got an extra ten k. Just put the common golds that you've got and the gold rays you've got from the daily gold into the premium mixed leagues. Now simply what you want to do here is complete these three SBCs. So you've got small rare small prime and a jumbo and then this side of the sbc here if you haven't got any lib and sud cards from anything else you're going to have to put some coins into because this is the more expensive side of the sbcs now the reason being because lib and sud cards essentially don't have a high drop rate in certain packs however with the 288s that we've just got there where i'm going to craft them into of course a section of packs what we're actually able to do is get a load of Lib and Sud cards from those because actually, weirdly enough, in the common golds that we get from the Lib and Sud packs or the, that we're trying to get from the Lib and Suds there, you get a ton of them in the exchange packs. Now, I don't know why this is, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop two 88s into exchange packs to show you as an example. Firstly, we're going to cross this pack here. So as you can see here, I've slotted in a load of these players and we're just going to essentially, you're looking for a little bit of chemistry. The rating is what makes these squads more expensive. So when you do get these players, of course, if you get anything sort of 65 and below, you can sell those on. If you can get a value from them, do it. The players that you're kind of looking to keep here are the 77s, the 76s, as you can see here. Chemistry isn't all that important, but what really is in this squad is rating. So you want to just boost that rating any way you can. You want to be getting as many of these high rated cards as you can you can see we're still creeping on that rate in there you just have to gradually upgrade them player by player we'll have to switch out the 66s for 69s anything else for for something slightly higher and eventually you'll get it and there you go we've got it on the last try i was pretty much out of options there but this sbc is really really good the prime electron players pack is kind of the 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 I guess the the peak of that because obviously you've got to do all of the other three in order to even get this one a lot of people struggle with that final stage of the SBC what we've got back from this or a lot of this this is all just going to be stuff that we're going to craft into other upgrade SBCs but the beauty of the league SBC method is you can keep crafting and crafting now what I want to show you guys because it's we've got the example here today that 
one of 83, you know, one of four 83 plus is a really, really good player pick. And obviously I've done all of mine. You guys are going to craft all yours, but we got two 88s there. So let's pop these both into the 88 upgrade SPC to get the result back. So we'll pop pop in. I don't need to pop the actual ones in because you, you saw me get the players. So it's two 27 player packs that we've got back. Now, obviously in these 27 player packs, I'm going to get a load of commons. I'm going to get a load of rares. And essentially by getting those two 88s, I've just crafted myself. It's, it's 27 extra extra players at each so we're looking at about 54 players so that's 54 more players to go into the picks the upgrades whatever it may be i can't believe how much ea have made it easy for us to craft by giving us those packs now let's do the 27 first what we got here this one is a slow burner oh, okay center mid that's not good united that's going to be ericsson so that's pretty trash 83 is our best card is never going to be nice now if we look through here not really got a lot there to offer. A lot of this is just going to be recrafted into other stuff. So we'll send these to the transfer and then obviously we'll craft the rest. And then we go on and we will do our next 27 players pack. Now, I actually have a lot of faith in these. They are very good. You can see I've crafted a lot. We've got English striker. Can we get Kane? No, I think this is going to be an 85, which isn't too bad. So we got daily, which isn't bad. We've got some 83s in there. Have we got any other? We've got an 84 as well. So realistically, a nice selection of players. And all of that helps us go and craft an 83 times 10. While we're here, we might as well pop open a 500 FIFA point pack. Of course, it's going to be trash. If there isn't a walkout here, we can just know for certain that EA is... I wish it wasn't a walkout because I'd like to call them scammers more often. Musiala and Modric, not too bad. Both of them, I'm going to be popping them into exchange SBCs realistically. Have we got anything else nice there? 86 Cruz, that's nice. We've got some informs. Informs are probably the most valuable thing at the minute, so I, I really can't complain. That'll be going into an 83 times 10. Now, now, obviously, with the 83 times 10, we can use players that we've received, obviously, throughout the exchanges. You've got the likes of Small in there. And obviously, 83s, 82s, they're very, very simple to get. Now, the inform is, in theory, the hardest part of that. Now, obviously, I've just packed one, and I'm not going to sit there and say that a FIFA point pack is going to contribute. Now, in order to get the informs in an organic way, in a way where you're not just opening packs and wasting money like myself, you're going to have to go and do the inform team of the week pick up, up upgrade. I can't speak. That's the upgrade you're going to have to do. Now, of course, that upgrade is a little bit tricky. So if we go over to it, let's have a look. Upgrades, it's it's going to take you two squads. Now, with this one, what I'd say is an advisory for this one, you just want to use duplicates. The easiest way when you're crafting through packs, when you're getting free stuff from your daily gold, your player picks, you will, I'll be honest, I don't think you're going to need to actually go and do that SPC. But if you've crafted everything else and you're ready to do an 83 times 10 and you haven't got an inform by then, then yeah, sure, do it. I would say the likelihood is by the time you get round to doing the 83 times 10, going through the crafting route, you will have got an inform along the way. I usually get them in 83 times 10s, which obviously doesn't help because I've got these already completed because I've got informs in the background. But in terms of other packs you're going to get them from i think the crafting upgrade that we've got at the minute your general sort of crafting that you can do i think that's probably going to be where you're going to find the most chance of an inform upgrade because this the three times 77 pack although they're not like a really big pack i found that across the promos that we've had these crafting upgrades whether it's been the team of the year the winter wild card we've had a lot I found that these 77 times threes have been really good for random, like 90 rated cards. I've had De Bruyne in one of these more recently. Obviously, sometimes it's going to be crap, but then even this Perez card, he's going to be really good for the league upgrades. And what's good in essence with all of this exchange packs and everything that we can craft into different things is that we've got a current upgrade with the, the crafting upgrade, which gives us the ability to use these players, to find a use for them. Now, you don't want to be doing anything like that. Quick selling players like I am. I'm just simply lazy. And that, that's kind of one of them things. Do as I say, not what I do. I'm lazy. I'm admittedly lazy. I waste a lot of coins. So do not be like myself. There, we've got a nice little pack. Obviously, Giles as the best player isn't great. But all of those cards came from giving an 85 in, in an exchange SPC. So it's a big win. Obviously, we're going to have to open the 83 times 10s just to see how good these are. Foot Fantasy is good. Is it Politano? We've already got him. And I don't want to sound ungrateful. It's just a shame to be putting a player who potentially gets an upgrade into an SPC where we're not going to get to see that. So we'll go pop him in an exchange SPC. How did we do for the rest of the pack? Not great, but if you haven't got the foot fantasies, it's obviously really nice to pack them. 20k there. I mean, I'll obviously have to put these into another type of SBC, but you can see how useful the, the crafting is at the minute. And obviously, the fact that we've got that crafting upgrade there. I mean, if you look at the reward for the foot fantasy crafting, I mean, it is pretty tasty. Let's have a look. If we go over to the live SBCs crafting, we've got 
83 times twos there. If we go all the way to kind of the, the 100 plus, 84 times twos, 81 times 11, player pick 1 and 4, 85, 83 times 10, 81 times 11, 83 times 10, 85 times 3, and then you get an 83 times 20. I think that's brilliant. Obviously, by the time that this finishes off, we've got 11 days to do it, so it's a lot of spamming in and spamming out obviously we've got the exchange packs i would save that pack for team of the season because i think that is an absolutely beautiful pack the other thing you need to do really really fast in your time subscribe to the channel make sure to drop a like down below and i'll see you tomorrow